Trousnader here, bringing you back to the world of Red Dead Redemption 2. As I fucking fix my camera, because like always, my camera just fucking falls apart. <laughs> um, we're just going to jump straight right back into the story. And we're going to reset everything and go through the whole fucking, the whole shenanigans once over again. Because I haven't played this game since, well, since it, like, came out. <laughs> in, like, 20, what was it, end, end of 2018? October, November, somewhere around there? I can't remember. But it's been a long time. Um, I was, I'm, I'm playing, also playing this because it's kind of like, like a remembrance of how to play this game. So if they ever, <laughs> if they ever do re-release uh, re or whatever the first one, since I played the original one, or since I played the first time, like, ten years ago, <laughs> more than ten years ago, I'm hoping that, uh, I know they said they weren't going to do it, probably because they're focusing on GTA 6, which also will get me back into, like, the controls and everything about it, um, which I have been playing for, you know, a little bit, a couple, a couple last couple weeks, I guess, um, but also... If they if they do fucking just be like oh yeah by the way we actually are releasing it <laughs> even though they said they aren't then uh, it'll give me a one up which is like the same thing I did with playing the Wolf Among Us again because the the second one is coming out this year sometime supposedly so it's kind of like a refresher of the story re refresher of the characters and stuff like that and yeah. So, I don't know, I guess it's going to drop me into, like, my existing story of what I have now. And it's, like, stuck at 90%, like, come on. Hey! Mr. John Marston. How's it going, sir? Um, so let's go, let's go play a new fucking game. Restart from the beginning. From the beginning of the beginning, is that is that is that a thing? Beginning of the beginning, because it's like the beginning of this game, but also the beginning beginning of the whole Red Dead story. Even though it's like a sequel, prequel, pre-story kind of malarkey shit. <laughs> the pre-tales of Red Dead One, but the pre-tale with the post-tales of the game series. I don't. <laughs> I don't know how to say this, but I've been having this weird itch to play this game after watching like a few video games, that, a few video games, a few videos that popped up in my um, in my YouTube feed about this game, and I was like, oh yeah, Red Dead Two. I wasn't a big fan of the, the online because maybe because I didn't have a lot of people to play with, but uh, yeah, I was like, you know. Red Dead 2, and I clicked on the video and I watched it, and I was like, I clicked another one, and then I clicked another one, and then I clicked another one, and you you, you see where I'm getting here. Um, you fall into the Red Dead rabbit hole, and then I'm like, you know what, I really want to play this game. So the last couple weeks I've been playing it with a friend of mine, kind of getting back into the control, controls and everything, and just fucking around and having fun. But, uh, yeah, here we are. About 1899, the age of outlaws and gunslingers was at an end. Unfortunately, because the old West I find is really cool. I was just found like a, I got like a warm fuzzy feeling from it. America was becoming a land of laws, crooked laws, and you know, even the West had mostly been tamed. Mhm. Mm I just want America to turn like shit into the modern day America, America we have today. <laughs> Uh, a few gangs still roamed, but they were being hunted down and destroyed. I remember this being so epic when I was like reading it. I was playing at like 7:30 in the morning <laughs> after coming home from night shift. Rockstar Games presents. What are we presenting here? Red Dead Redemption 2. Woo! It's funny when this game came out, everyone was like, oh my god, Rockstar is making another game. 
it's like GTA but with cowboys. And I was like, yeah, this is going to be awesome. And, and like all our, all us uh, first time players of the first one were like, fuck yes, we finally got a sequel to this. I wonder what's gonna, you know, what's gonna happen. And they're like, oh, it's a prequel. Okay, cool. It's even better. You get to figure out because there's so many unanswered questions and things that were brought up in the first one that. I mean, I had to go back and play it again. That's why, if there was a re-release, it'd be cool. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay, Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Good old fucking Dutch. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. <laughs> there. Arthur. Fucking... Arthur, is that you? <laughs> <laughs> I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let <laughs> uh, Davy rest, buddy. You know. Jerks off of it or gets fucking town. fluffed. Man, it ain't far. Come on. Good old fucking Arthur, Come man. On. Come on, Arthur. We gotta do it for the gang. It's <laughs> fucking fools. Oh my god. Just fucking bring you back memories. <laughs> I remember playing this when it came out the morning of um, with a with a with a with a former friend of mine. We were playing it together, like kind of like separate, but whatever. Chapter one, Coulter. So we were playing it together, but you know what I mean, because it's a single player game. We were playing it together, like we were doing our own stories, but just in a party talking and stuff. It was pretty cool. He's like, "Oh my God, there's people in here. No, what's going on here? It's like it's fucking." It's a fucking old mine town, there's nobody here. So of course... Oh, it's fucking Abigail. It's the fucking, uh... Oh, it's Bill. And Arthur. And Dutch. And, uh... I don't know who that was. Miss Gaskell, get that fire fucking Abigail and the fucking commun <laughs> the communal whore. <laughs> Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food? See that chef? That's a chef, right? Davy's dead. Oh no, no, Davy's not the fucking Nothing chef. Nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need some guys. <laughs> Those coins. First of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna. It's <laughs> funny if they were fucking slices of frozen, frozen cucumber. <laughs> Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out. Uh, See if we can find one of them. And this. Oh, that's a bit. I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Come on, Arthur, we can do it. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had well, a bad couple of days. I know shit. I loved Davy. Fucking Davy. Jenny. Sean, Mac, they might be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I. Imagine. Throw myself in the ground in their stead. I'd do it. Imagine if they made but, a Red Dead 3 and did a prequel to a prequel. But of how the game like formed out. and came together. That would be even fucking sicker. Food. That'd be the illest. <laughs> we're safe now. There ain't nobody. She said we're safe for now. Like this one. There's the chef, the but guy in the back with the fucking here, losing hair on top of his head. We're gonna be long gone. Yeah, we're gonna be fucking somewhere so gone, somewhere far. Before. Mr. Pearson. Mr. Pearson, that's what I need this shit. Mrs. Grimshaw. <laughs> Not Mrs. Grimshaw. Here for a few days. Now all of you. Oh my God, is that an uncle? <laughs> it is fucking Get uncle. Imagine how cold Stay it was back strong. then, because they only had lamps, they didn't have Stay heating or anything. Look at, look, look, look at this. We ain't done yet. Like, you look at this house, and, like, Come the on, windows are all smashed in. The doors aren't Hurry. even, like, fitted properly to, like, the door frame. So, like, there's still fucking cold coming in. And back then, there was more snow and more everything, and no global warming, really. So it was even fucking colder. <laughs> I ain't had time to ask. Oh, fuck you. You what fucking really first-time chat bot people. We you. That's what happened. Come on. I can't bullshit. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith. <laughs> Mr. Fucking Smith. Need to rest that hand. I'll live. Uh. Get indoors, son. 
Is that Lenny? Is that Lenny? Is that mean? Let's go Dutch route. Get the fuck out of the way. Oh, you're going that way. My bad. <laughs> Sorry. Going the wrong way. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. Jesus Christ. I know, it's fucking, this is gnarly, man. He used to get so, like... Not this bad, but, like, it was pretty, like, hectic sometimes. When I was a kid, it, it was cool, though. Because we got to play in it. <laughs> and fucking wrestle and spear each other off mountaintops and fucking... Amazing stuff like that. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> what are you doing? Suck my dick. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. Yeah. We need to get those people. No more. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. We don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. A couple more days, we'll be on the other side. It's also cool that they left. If you don't, if no one, if people watching don't know, they left Blackwater and went like northeast-ish, east northeast-ish. I like how they added to like the old map. It was kind of cool. We got up here. You up ahead. Who's there? Who is it? How did they even see me, buddy? How the fuck did they even see that? Micah. Micah. Gentlemen, found anything? I think Jeez. so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Yeah, fuck Anyone him. home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a motherfucking doll. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. <laughs> Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. Oh shit. This is fucking like pretty like beautiful at the same time as being hectic and a pain in the ass. Micah's a fucking. Micah is a tank, to be honest. Have you seen John Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope. Yeah, until we get to Red Dead. Until we get to the end of Red Dead 1, then it's like, hmm, not really. Arthur, let me take the rear. You move up. Whoa. Okay. If you wanna fucking stare at my horse's ass, I'm uh, I guess I'm okay with that. You run into anybody else? I <laughs> I reckon we're the only ones crazy enough to be out in this, Morgan. Yeah. Yeah, well. Don't talk to Just me about Craig. Oh, so no glad you're all right. I See, they already had fucking beef from the beginning here. It's all gonna work out, Morgan. We lost a few folks, but that's just how it goes sometimes. Well, I'm glad you're feeling so good about it. <laughs> Where are all the others? In a fucking cabin. Back up the hill. Okay, let's keep it down now, gentlemen. Oh, yeah, Captain. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns. Ooh. Ooh. Let's shoot two baby. On this. Oh. oh, baby, look at that. Okay. Let's head down there. I'm just jump off the cliff and call it a day. I think that's a better idea. Health is the play in the lower left corner. Okay. Wouldn't it be like the upper left corner compared like for the mini map? Let's hitch up here. Okay. I love you always have to hitch your horse because it's not like your horse is gonna fucking go anywhere. <laughs> In this fucking weather, I don't think your horse is gonna go anywhere, but you you never know, right? And just fuck off and fuck everyone else. Let me handle this. That's why I really feel bad for these in these winters is the fucking horse because the horse has to just fucking sit here and wait for you. Like what the fuck? Someone's having fun in there. Huh. Someone's fucking someone's jerking off fucking Uncle Tommy. Three nasty looking degenerates. <laughs> Micah, hide behind that way. Degenerates. Arthur, you take that old shed on the left and stay okay. low, both of them. 
take some cover, boys. Fucking... Who's playing the fiddle in there? Although it's like a two-floor cabin, which is pretty cool. Who's stroking someone else's fiddle? Hello? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hello? Oh, uh, hello, <laughs> what you want? Oh my god. I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way. Lost <laughs> in the storm. Ah, gentlemen. That's just playing these fools. You, mister. I got folks. Are they dying on the trail? We got a problem. Uh-oh. <laughs> There's a corpse right here. Uh-oh. You know, I, I just need some... There's a body in the wagon. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. I think you should go now, buddy. Done, boys. Fuck you, asshole. Oh my god. One died in one shot, dude. Holy shit, dude. Light him up. Who's left? Oh, this guy. I'm gonna get him. I got him, I got him, I got him, I got him, I got him. Well, I'm getting stuck. I'll get him. Fuck you, asshole. You ain't going nowhere. You ain't going nowhere. You ain't getting away from... Getting away from me. Oh, won't even let me in? Oh my god, not the old Driscolls. Fuck. Not those sister fucking butt fucking dildo licking motherfuckers. The fucking O'Driscolls, I hate them boys. What do we got? Ooh. What kind of photos we got here? What is this? Who is this? Which O'Driscoll is this? Looks like the poor Jake and Sadie. At some point. Interesting. Oh my god, is that, is that Sadie, uh... What's her name? Spra Sadie Spradler, or whatever the fuck her name is? A little white girl who fucking can fire a gun like a motherfucker. Ooh, cigarettes too? Nice. Or oat cakes. Sorry, I thought they were fucking cigarettes with oat cakes. Mmm. It's like fucking rice cakes, like nowadays rice cakes, but oat cakes, interesting. Oops, uh, I didn't mean to go first person. Uh, where did my, uh... Oh, it's a satchel, there we go. I was like, where the hell is it? I'm salting me, I'll take that. dry, warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. Let's hold. Okay. We'll see how they all get back. I don't really want us to split up. Okay. What else we got here? Any canned goods? Assorted biscuits. Nice. Canned vegetables. There we go. Canned fruit. Interesting. Is canned fruit any good? Well, I guess peaches and pears you can can, right? They're pretty good. All I had back then was canned shit. Grab anything you think we can use, then meet me out here. Okay. What else we got here? Oh, on Dutch. Ah, oat cakes, nice. Is that it? Ooh. Ooh, I wonder what's in here. Coin purse, nice. 
a dollar seventy-eight. That's like that can buy you a whole bunch of groceries to last you like a month. <laughs> Jewelry. Okay, cool. That'll be worth a lot. That'll be worth like ten dollars, and that's like ten dollars you can spend to buy a whole new outfit. I don't know. <laughs> okay, I think we're good. Micah, Arthur, people we can touch. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, fuck, look how high the snow is, like up to past your knees. Sure. That's crazy. Who's in here? Who's in here? Oh! Oh my god! <laughs> fucking cut the sister fucker, fuck you. What's going on? This guy's getting annihilated. Boom. Done. Sneaky little bastard. Should I kill him? No. Beat the shit out of him. So not yet. Another fucking Andrews case. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Fucking beat the shit out of him. <laughs> Grab him by the throat. An old mining camp southwest of here. Aye, 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 Captain. What are you bastards doing? <laughs> I punch and he and then he answers a question. <laughs> and then he asks a question. Gonna blow the tracks. Wow. I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> Motherfucker knows more than that. Well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. Oh. But bring that horse when you're done. Yeah, we got a free horse out of this. I don't know anything else. Oh, come on, tell us. Tell us, you fool. Tell us. Oh, it's too late now. <laughs> Damn it, I want to fucking choke him. Oh man. I was hoping that he would have fucking spoke up. Please, give me my hat. Give me my fucking hat back, you fucking fool. Oh well. He's dead. We don't need that motherfucker anyway, his whole family is dead. <laughs> Come on, horsey. It's okay. It's okay, buddy. It's okay. It's okay, buddy. We're gonna help you get out of this fucking barn and bring you into life. Let's go, horsey. Let's go, horsey. Down the street we go. Yeah, he's kind of dead. Damn right, sir. I'll show you fucking Bolton. Michael Bolton. What the hell? What the fuck, dude? Oh man, where was she? Oh, in the cellar. Jeez. Oh my god. Oh, she's fucking in the base. Oh, what the hell? Oh my god. Look what you did. Oh my god. Oh my god. We mean you no harm, Miss. Jesus Christ. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Jesus Christ, dude. They kept her in the fucking cellar? Or did she hide in the cellar? <laughs> That's a real question. Three days ago. Okay. They kill her husband and she fucking Jesus. Safe now. Can't stay here. No, you can definitely not fucking stay here. It's burning down, motherfucker. Come with us. It's, it's okay. <laughs> Good old Arthur. Man. We ain't them. <laughs> We're bad hey, men, but we ain't them. Okay. Jesus Christ. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. I guess I guess the mon I guess the, the moniker uh Good people do bad things and bad people do good things. 
Sadie. Sadie Adler. Sadie Adler. That's her. Okay. Who is this? Hey. Why did I, what did I say? What did I say? Oh, the guy on the fucking, out in the cart there. What did I say? Her name was Sadie something. <laughs> I don't remember. So stupid. Oh my god. He killed them O'Driscolls. Hey, there's, there's Lenny. Yeah, it's us, you fucking idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Who else would it be? Yeah, what about fucking Arthur and Micah? He weren't to the first? We found this lady. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found okay, why don't we just go inside? Why are we all outside, dude? Well, Miss Adler now. She's kind of like Miss Adler now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. <laughs> you guys don't do anything fucking days. anything different. <laughs> You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan? Look how that rhymes. Miss O'Shea will memory? show you the way. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mrs. Mr. Grimshaw. Over there. What? How come Arthur gets a room when I get a bunk bed next to <laughs> Bill Williamson? <laughs> and Bill. Get yourself to <laughs> Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies. I mean, it's better than fucking. I guess it's better. I mean, it's pretty bad, but it's better than saying you know what, but. What the fuck and a bunch of darkies? That just, it's just, it's mind blowing when you hear you, I think, not hearing that for such a long time. It feels like I, I'm hearing it for the first time again. Jeez. Ain't been seen in days. Well, I mean, white people are, are, are ladies. Like. He's strong, and he's smart. Strong at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Who? Arthur. Oh, How John. Maybe. I don't. Know. Just fine, Abigail. That's what he's talking about. Oh. You. I need you to. You gotta I'm go sorry, find John, right? Ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two, two days. Your John will be fine. <laughs> I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing Damn. because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier, hey, this look will look for him. Come on now. Javier, will you hey, Javier. Arthur, to take a look for John. You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. <laughs> I know... The situation were reversed. He looked for me. So... Thank you. Everyone's, everyone's like... Everyone seems to be like, Fuck John. Fuck that this guy. He gets himself into trouble. Fuck him. <laughs> he didn't figure it out himself. John was headed up the river. He wouldn't leave. I like that. No, John wouldn't no, do that. Wouldn't be the first time. John would be fucking smart enough to fucking leave, but he has Abigail left behind, and yeah, no, I don't leave your wife like that or whatever. I guess they're not really technically married. Are they? Were they? I don't think they are technically married. Or even, I don't know. Back then you got married, but like, I don't know. It wasn't really, <laughs> there wasn't, well, I guess there was, I guess there was like friends with benefits, but like, or dating and stuff like that, I don't know. Seems somebody left. All you did back then was have sex and go to bed. <laughs> and work. <laughs> and eat, because there's nothing else to do. Oh my god. And ride your horse, I guess. There's some tracks leading to the river. Fucking Javier. Fuck man, I, I really wanna... I really want to play the first one again. But number one, I don't feel like... Don't fuck. I don't feel like buying a PS3 again. And then trying to find... And then two, trying to find Red Dead again. And then like... Setting it up. Or 
sorry, let's just say one, buying a PS3 and buying Red Dead 1. Two, finding a PS3, to, or finding a, uh, a setup and like figuring a setup out to set up, to hook up the PS3 again. And then like, I don't know, I don't know where I'm going with this. But it'd be fun to play the first one again, but it'd be a pain. It'd be a pain in the ass to go uh, collect everything to play it. Oh. Oh fuck. Fuck! I want to play Red Dead One, man. I wish they had just fucking re-release it. Both shot two. Oh, shit. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Is Sean the, the, the Irish kid? For my recollection, I don't know. Damn snow's coming in hot again. Jesus we'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. It's almost like we're not even following tracks, there's just fucking snow everywhere. <laughs> Is Javier our, our only Mexican dude? Everyone else is either, either white or black. Oh no, I think they're, I think they're, it's not the, is there any Molly, that, the Irish woman? Where are we fucking going, dude? We're walking on ends. Edges yeah, of cliffs. A lot of fresh snow here. Uh, I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe For some reason, Arthur's like, ah, oh, fuck, fuck this shit, fuck John. Javier's like, come on, he would do the same for us if we were out here. Hey, look! Over there! You see that? Oh, yes. A dead... Horse. John was riding that horse when we yep. Black a dead horse. Let's see if he can hear us. Oh my gosh. Hold on.
Okay, I'm back. As we look, oh, pff, sorry, on. sorry, John's horse. Just fucking stepped on your face. As we look for uh, Mr. Johnny Gabadi. Where are we going to have here? Where must we go? I think my camera moved again. Oh, I think I hear him. Fuck, that was too hot. Hold on. There we go. That's better. Fuck, we got a walk, man. I grabbed that shotgun from your Who knows what's Wait, was, a, was a shotgun on my horse? Amazing. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. Horse, puppies. Oh, hold that one, my bad. Okay, let's go Javier. What the fuck? <laughs> Do we have to go to get Mr. Johnny? Jesus Christ. Where the fuck is he? <laughs> We're on the side of a mountain, it's pretty sketchy. Here, This is fucking sketchy. Any any moment, this fucking snow could crumble from below our feet, and we could just die. Holy shit, dude! Oh my god! Hmm. Huh. Who are we gonna kill now? Shit! Oh my god! You make the wrong. Oh my god! Look how far! Oh my god! Jesus Christ, you make the wrong the wrong step and you fucking just collapse to your death. What the fuck? So random. Okay, Good place to hide actually. Watch your step. This is real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Your stamina core is empty. Fuck this shit. Come on. Oh my god. Come John. On. Oh. I hear him. Where is he? Come on. We're coming, John. <laughs> so I'd be a pain and they have to climb. Oh my god. Where is he? It's cold. It's not like he was just here. Like <laughs> John, where the fuck did you go? Why is he so like up like in the mountains? The fuck. It's a few days. I know. <laughs> he drinking? <laughs> Here, take a drink of this. Thanks. Kentucky this bourbon. So, the fuck, dude? Then. Come on. You brought bourbon with the helmet. Where the fuck is down here? Down here? Over here. Oh. Alright. <laughs> He's down here. Hey. There he is. That's our boy. How the fuck did he how did he, what did he do? Sit here How long is he sitting here? Dude? Say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. Yeah, that's and this is the this is the fucking story of how we got his fucking the big scratch, the big scar on his face. From them wolves. <laughs> how he didn't die is fucking amazing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Mm. And it's also said that he uh, throughout this game, and I think even the first one he mentions. Um, being blind in one eye or somewhat blind or whatever, and this is called this is why because the wolf attack. Hmm. Amazing. We did it. 
You got John. What the fuck? Why we just? Oh, oh no. Look up there. Oh no. Oh, our horses are here. Okay. Oh fuck, dude. You head for the horses. Oh, fuck. The whole fucking the whole fucking clan's here. Clan Wolf. Okay, here we go, John. We'll lead them to Arthur. Where'd they go? Oh fuck, they're there. You fucking old school motherfuckers. Oh no. Ah. No, 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 <laughs> don't jump into the wolf. No. Ow. No. Oh. Fucking Dark Souls dodging, dude. Ow. Fuck you. Asshole. Can we skin these boys? No, I guess not. Fuck. I want to skin them all. I want to skin these motherfuckers. I want to make Arthur the biggest superhuman destroying weapon as... Mo as... I don't know where I was going with that. I want to make Arthur the super... I want to make him like Arnold. I want to make him a fucking super destroying human machine monster beast thing. Got bit by a dog. Died. An hour later. You ain't oh. gonna die. Not yet. <laughs> John ain't gonna die. Spoiler alert, he doesn't die until More much later day. on. He doesn't die until the end of the first game. Fucking stupid dog. Oh fuck, I was Jesus Christ. Oh no, it's more. More coming in on the left. Stay back. Get the hell out of here. Get out. Fucking, fucking stupid dogs or wolves. Just run them over. See any more out there? No, think so. No, they were good. Jesus. You still with us, Marston? <laughs> Just about. It's almost getting worse now. Okay. Dude, we got two dollars and twenty-one cents. Amazing. Me. Horse. That bullet in Blackwater. Now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur always says, I'm lucky. <laughs> None of us are lucky right now. Everyone's fucking lucky we're still alive. You idiot. We should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that <laughs> star. So, freezing, bleeding, starving? Damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. <laughs> yeah, it's been a story. It's a pretty good yeah. story. I fought off some wolves and they got me. Like, is it not a good enough story? What are you gonna say? I fucking fell. That's where we camped. Nearly there. Hey yo, we're back, boyos. Hello, everybody. We're here. I mean, you could help him off the horse, but I don't know why you're being so lazy. It's Grimshaw. We get some help. We need some help. Motherfuckers, where is everybody? Oh, there they are. Here we go. There we go. Ay, careful, idiotas! It's his leg. Come on, let's get you warm. Careful, idiotas. Thank you, Thank you both. This is a new love, even by your standards. Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. you. any other lost maidens need saving? Hmm. <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? Hell, this nope. Just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. Well, Herr Strauss, I guess. We'll have to keep is. heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization? I know. <laughs> the west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Oh, yes, because in the west, during this time, uh, places like Armor Armadillo or Armorillo and um, uh, what, what are they called? Um, anyway, places like Armorillo and um, we found shelter and been resting here and some old tumbleweed were all we abandoned by a or were all abandoned because of a plague or oh, abandoned. Well, I guess yeah, abandoned kind of because of a plague, and that's why they were going east because of the plague that was there. 
but in the first one you end up going back. Um, in Red Dead 1 you end up going back west. And you end up going... Um, yeah, you end up going back west and then like back in the black water and all that play and tumbleweed and everything. So you're playing to unlock your bonus content. Amazing. Let's go Javier. What's going on, buddy? Good morning. Another cold yeah, another cold oh, fucking boys, because I nightmare. Couple of days on the lamb. <laughs> you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, cool. Shut up, Micah. I ain't oh never God. seen so many He's long racist. faces. Mm. I guess, I guess folks missed them. I fell, but when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, <laughs> there'll be a party. Party? <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> oh, jeez. I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. <laughs> Stop it now. You fools punch me. Michael always caused problems. Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around, wait for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Folks have been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como Driscoll. I love how Arthur was in such good shape and he smoked a lot. Like, Dutch. He's here <laughs> for us. I doubt that. No, nope, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You. You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Exactly. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators here. Cole <laughs> always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? All right. Now you my fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson, would you please look after the place? There are O'Driscoll's about. <laughs> yeah! The fucking white horse. <laughs> southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. He said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay, let's go How do you even know which way is north? They find us. How would you even know which way is which? Like, I don't, I don't get it. Do they, do they have a compass? Are those, are compass is a thing at this point in time? I mean, guns were, so I don't know why a compass wouldn't be. Hmm. Fuck. I'm gonna raid those motherfuckers. Build, build horse is fucking weird. It's so, like, big. It's big like him. Thick like him. <laughs> What's that? Tracks. Horses, quite a few oh. of them. Oh yeah. As far as I can tell, the only fools out here are us and them. Let's go they kill them old Driscolls, them sister fuckers. You we don't fuck our own sister, we fuck our, our gang member sisters. <laughs> That's why we're better than them, because we don't be someone to fuck our own okay. sisters. We you fuck other people's sisters. <laughs> I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, and people you love will die. This feud nice. between you and him needs to be put to rest one way or another. Damn right it does. It will be. Some things I can forgive, others I can forget. What he did to Hannibal, I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yeah. Yes, I did. Oh. The bastards will be reunited soon enough. Damn. That's how this will end. That's cool. That's, ag that's fucking aggressive. Let's cut up here and take a look. They that was aggressive, dude. Lake, so we must be close. What's some Oh, there. Okay. You say what smoke? Oh, there, uh, there it is. You gonna fuck these boys up? Hold up here. Watch out. <laughs> what are you doing, Dutch? <laughs> Dutch, what are you doing? All right, gentlemen. The fuck? This is it. 
<laughs> Are we goddamn ready? ready yes. Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Amazing. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Uh -huh. Let's go. Let's fucking do this shit, boyos. We're going to fucking scavenge the camp. Let's scavenge, we're going to see scavenge the same time. Or scour the camp. Are we even close enough? It didn't look like we were close enough. We're fucking peeping toms. Ayo. There they are. That's definitely them. Home? I think so. Yeah, that's him. That one right there, yeah. There's one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. <laughs> this guy's running weird. So there's only six of them. Maybe maybe there's more. He don't seem very happy. No. Oh my god. Oh! Dude, he just slapped that person. They leave Twice. Him? To be. Should we go get him? No. Colin can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. Jeez. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. Alright. Let's go pay our yeah, that's pretty cool. I'd like to go down there and fucking just pop him in the head, but you know. We we'll always gotta do it fucking the, uh, the interesting way. You two, get up there. There's not something you know that. Oh, so. So, uh. Leave that there and took the shotgun. Good. Come on, let's go. Okay. Got my fucking carbine repeater. Oh, good. To take the same path down as Bill and Micah. Hi, like Captain. Said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. This is revenge, is not? Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including coal, can wait. Okay. There's enough yes, I know. bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now come on. I only saw like six or seven of them, including coal. So I don't know. This is going to be a little fucking sneaky weaky like. Pretty big camp, actually. Oh, we're only looking at like one little part, okay. So you just walk on in. Walk on in. We'll go, hey, what's going on, fools? Who perfectly made this path to get down here? This is, this is very... This is very sketchy. <laughs> gonna shoot them up. We're gonna shoot them sister fuckers up. We're gonna light them up like a bag of bag of bricks in September. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I'm saying. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're gonna be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, mm. but the way our luck's been running, hush. Let's just get down there first. We are down here. Fuck, I'm gonna pop something with this bad boy. Stay low. Ha ha ha, that's gonna be amazing. They're like right there, do they not see us? 
Oh, that Micah. My bad. Those are, those are all, that's our team. So, what are we doing, Dutch? Oh, fuck. I can take this if you want. Just play the call. You want to take the lead? Go. Bang. Oh, this is what we wanted to do. Oh, fuck, fuck you. I'm not. Fuck. Oh. Nice. Nice. Oh fuck, I didn't even see that guy. Did not see that guy at all. Just back here. <laughs> Call me a coward. I just fucking popped you in the head. Oh, missed. Oh! Nice. Oh fuck, didn't even see this guy. <laughs> that took three bullets, dude. I missed. You laughing son of a whore. Fucking crouch. You laughing son of a whore. I've never heard that one before. How the fuck? Ah. Dude, okay. So how did all those miss? Oh. What? Damn, dude. They got me. Damn. I thought it was just... Wasn't it just that one guy there? Wasn't it just him? Wasn't he the last one? What the fuck? So. That kinda sucks to be honest. What are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You wanna take the lead? Go. We don't have time to debate this. Oh god, okay, well... You can't fucking win either way. Nope. No, what are you doing? Oh. That works. Damn, dude. This guy's... Oh! Damn, dude. Damn, right in the head. Come on, miss. That was right in the fucking base of first one. Tough. Who's left? There's a guy over there. Oh, it's one over my little cabin. Done. Ho! Oh. Hey, your buddy in the fucking barn is the one that got it on you. That guy, not, that guy really didn't die. Dude. Some of these fucking guys take a lot of bullets. Holy shit. Two of them left. Some of them just fucking, I don't get it. Some of them take two, like, two or three bullets. Some of them just take one. I may mean, get the ones that I shot, you know, shooting the head. Some of them are shooting like the upper chest and they don't fucking die. Oh. Oh, I got fucking. Where did that guy come from? Where did that guy come from? I can't get out of nowhere. Oh, they have the green handkerchief. Oh, what are you telling? Dollar for nice. Cigarettes? Nice. Lots of ammo. Is this the guy that was up there? Or... This is a different guy. Heads up, boys. We got more oh, fuck. The okay, hold on. Let me get up top. So I can get a better scout of them. Oh yeah, that guy that fell down was a guy. Fuck. 
Motherfucker. Jeez. Fuck, it's just horses just running around. Where are the other ones? Oh, they're pretty far down. Okay. Well, I should go help them. Oops. Hold on, boyos. I think you have to finish looting all these guys. Fucking go after him, fuck him. Okay, okay. Oh, nice. Oh. Light that guy up. Done. Kill this guy. Fuck that job, dude. These guys can't fucking take us. Done. Oh. Oh, that guy's running away. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, there he is. Fuck you. You prick. Motherfucker, thought he could get away. Hold on, that's when I get some loot. I want to get all the good stuff. Select the eye tonic. Oh, okay. okay. Oh, I read uh, replenished my dead eye. Hold on. I want to loot that one guy that was over here. Where is he? Ah, oh, there he is. <laughs> this poor fool. Okay, I just... I did select the Itonic. There we go. I got that guy. Oh, these ones over here I didn't get. Trying to improve my stamina. My stamina nina. Hold on, Dutch, I'm coming. Just trying to get as much loot as I can. I love, I love loot. Especially when it's off dead old Driscoll's? Fuck yeah. Too. Oh, we're good. I think we're good. Parker, get over here. Yeah, hold on. Hold on. We gotta loot these boys. Okay, I'm here. Good work, boys. Now, let's tear this place apart. That's my horse. Oh. You search that wagon there. Come on, search that building. Parker, you take that building. Oh yeah, Captain. What have we got in here? Definitely no dynamite in here, right? This looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. Smells good. Come on. That was easy. Did we get everything? <laughs> think so, boss. Didn't mean to make it that easy, brother. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh yeah, interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Ah. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. Mr. Levit Leviticus Cornwall. All right. 
fancy Let's name. Oh, fucking Bill's Over horse, man. Not a man down. Good work, fellers. Not bad for some starving down and outs. <laughs> they can pummel us hard as they like. But we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Outlaws. Like Damn straight. Wait until we have John, Mac, Charles, and Sean back riding with us, and I believe oh, I'll be crazy, dude. They will all be back. Well, you didn't get combed, but this head will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train. Oh, too. yeah. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed, we will. You know, he'll come after us. Oh, then we'll fuck him up. Will, just like all the rest. But we're going to stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. <laughs> I don't know about that. All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground. Going across the lake, or just along the road by the lake. Fuck you, Dutch. I want to pass you. You and your stupid white horse. See that fella? Was me at camp cone? Leave him to me. All right. We're heading back. Just bring him back alive. He could be useful. Okay. You got it. Kill. They kill this man's horse. Yeah. Oh. Or just last one, okay, that works too. Get away from me! Fucking kill his horse. It's the easy part. Yeah. No. <laughs> That's the fun part, you kill the guy's horse. Murder the guy's horse and it's easy. I'll loot him. We'll put him on the horse. This is uh, very kind of you. Tuh. Just let me go. Come on. Fuck you. Oh God, no. We got you, boyo. Where was he just rambling in, in the in What's your name, boy? middle of nowhere? I don't know. You don't know your name. It's Karen. Karen what? Duffy. Karen Duffy. Well. I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, <laughs> Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere the camp. you ain't gonna lie. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna lie. <laughs> so I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No, please! Poor guy. This poor soul. Just gonna get fucking sat on by Bill and farted on. You're hurting me. Well, you're hurting my fucking horse. <laughs> the weighing so much. Oh, please. You better shut your mouth, you little shitter. I oh. will shut it for you. Is he a little shitter or is he a big shit? That's a real question. How far is camp, dude? I don't wanna die, mister. I've only been running with them a couple of months. Please, I'll do anything. Are you trying to test me? Is that it? Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> sorry. Okay. Jeez. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay. Okay. <laughs> That's two bones right there. Huh. <laughs> Jeez. Ah. We here, boys. We do the most side. <laughs> here we are, you sack of shit. Tough. Let's introduce you to the boys. I thought, what are you doing? Tough. We're gonna 
walking weirdly with that horse. Don't hurt me, please. Who's who's telling this fire outside? Why are they letting it burn? You found a little shit, did you? Yeah. It's all rain the snow. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. You want me to make him talk? Oh, oh. no, now all we'll get is lies. Oh, uncle, shoot. Mr. Williamson. Hey, uncle. Tie this maggot up someplace safe. And uncle wasn't we fucking really that old. First. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting. Save fellas as need saving. <laughs> and feed them as need feeding. We are gonna find out. What you need. Huh. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp! I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister! I, I hate that fella! Oh, whatever you say, son! <laughs> well done, Arthur. See, yeah, I'm just sorry Driscoll. we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. Let's go to the fire, let's tend the fire over here. Cause nobody else is. Oh, it's dark and dreary. And dreary. Good old winter time. Phil. That fat fuck. <laughs> With a receding hairline. What do we got over here? Who we got? Who do we got over here? Oh, uh, Pearson. We're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. We're no okay. Shit. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? Huh. Ten, twelve people? Yes. When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you huh. got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. 50 days. You unfortunately survived. Huh. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. But when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be <laughs> cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the <laughs> I sent Lenny and Bill hunting and they uh, found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. <laughs> Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough of this. I'll go find something. Hey, it's Come fucking, on. it's fucking Charles, dude. Wait a second. Oh. Hold on. Charles, yeah. you're back. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted off. Starving would be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go on. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. <laughs> Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? <laughs> Dude, if anyone can do it, it's fucking Charles. He knows he knows the land, man. <coughs> Charles is is the OG hunter. So we can figure this shit out. Yeah. You take this. I can't use it and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. <laughs> use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. Yeah. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. I wonder how old Arthur is. I Come feel on. like he's like this way. 30, 40 maybe? And late 30s, early 40s maybe? I thought back then like people lived to like 50 and oh. died. <laughs> that was like it. How are you up, you either got fucking... I'm okay. you, either got a, you either got a cold, a flu, fucking tuberculosis or something, you died. It'll be fine Killed you. I just can't pull a boat right now. I uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. So, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill? I would hope so. <laughs> Who even is the fucking old Driscoll's? Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. <laughs> now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. We'll head up this way, find some higher ground. Well, we'll just fucking eat the old Driscoll's. Been a wild few days, alright. That right north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm. Going out for John, that thing with the O'Driscolls. You've had a lot put on. A lot on. of shit. Hell, the O'Driscolls even fucking carry over until the fucking I first day. Like that. That's a cool part. Back, I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. Me neither. Well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good.
Yeah, Dutch killed some girl and that's fucking... I did some wrong doing and that was it. Just like Dutch does wrong doing all the time, right? Mike could probably told him to kill the girl. He fucking did it. Charles, where the fuck's all the food? There's some patches of grass here. Where's all the food at? Good. Let's look down this way. We're getting hungry, yeah. Charles. We're getting hungry. The wind's died down too. That's good. No wind at all is bad, but if it's too strong, they won't move. No shh. Stay quiet. Hmm. Stop here a second. I see something. Whoa! Uh, careful. What do we see here? Should I get a bow out? Actually, it's a bow on. There's deer been here. Recently. How can you tell? I should study my horse. I'll track them on foot. You could have pat my horse, horse too. That's exactly what I was gonna do. Okay, we're on. Keep down. Move quietly and slowly. Okay. You see the tracks? I don't think so. Everything is so fucking shiny. Oh yeah. What do we got anyway? Is it like a deer or a rabbit? Something good, hopefully, something big, big and meaty. Oh. By the water side. What's oh, this one? What do we got? Oh, there it is. Shh. It. Down there. You see him? Are you ready with that bow? From this far? In the neck or head. Quick and clean. Fuck. Get good tension on the string before releasing. Just don't overdo it. There we go. Nice. Fucking beautiful shot, Arthur. That was nice. A nice fucking juicy fucking deer. Look at that. Look at that. Look at motherfucking that. Right in the fucking heart, dude. R roughly. Um. Can I, like, pick it up? I guess not. Yeah, I guess not. Oh, what's that over there? What do we got over there? Oh, no. Ooh. Another one. Oh, it's two of them. Let me study the let me study this animal. Oh, 
How close are they get to study the animal? Right in the head, dude. Well I think that's all we can carry. Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the no, other. No, no need to, uh... You sure your hands okay? No need to waste food, right? Okay. Nice. Two beautiful fucking deers. Look at the thing. Arthur just carries it like a fucking beast. He's sick to fucking kill a deer and, like, just carry it back. At the same time, it'd be pretty evil, right? On a horsey. What are you doing over there? Well, why is my horse on that side? What are you doing, horse? Horse, what are you doing? Motherfucker, get over here. <laughs> Why'd you go to the other side? Come on. You're fucking cleaning your feet, okay. Come on. This horse is fucking lazy, man. This horse is fucking lazy, doesn't fucking move at all. Ready to head back when you are. Come on, Let's go, Charles. Hey there! Oops. Bye. Nice work, Arthur. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him! I knew you'd be okay with that bow. They're pretty good, actually. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Seems to me we should be putting our effort into getting off. This it's weird. This gang is like Soon, looked at as like terrible people, but then like some of the people in the actual gang are actually like good people. Like, they're cool people. Until we get some more thaw. It's weird. You're probably right. And even if we do get off here, what that? Still have a big price on our heads. This is a big country. We'll find somewhere to lie <laughs> low. Dutch yeah, okay. and Jose will have a plan. Fucking Jose, yeah. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his <laughs> hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go. Oh. And he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. <laughs> Good that we caught more than one. That's true. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. We ain't That's seen true. Neil Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and all <laughs> Pearson was kind enough to give us. The girl. The fuck is a, what is a awful? Look in her eye. Of course. She lost her husband, her home, everything That's a lot, she had. A lot of things. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. <laughs> <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that Probably. fight. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. Right. What is it with the O'Driscolls? Your sister fuckers. I suppose. Yeah, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Uh, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, yeah, they're fucking fools. They we've been scrapping doing. over scores with them for years. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Cole, and Dutch go way back. And not in a good Probably way. fighting over a fucking Probably over a girl. Watch out! A oh, up ahead. let's see if we can find another way around. Why don't we just fucking shoot the sh fucking shit out of it? Why don't we just fucking kill it? Fuck the bear, dude. Fuck the bears. The bears. Why? The bear's going this way. Why are we following it? Here, okay, boy. We ain't ever talked that much. 
about you, man. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Probably not. Being up here? Ah. Uh, sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. And I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? <laughs> oh. No, not at all. No, you can run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly <laughs> <different>. <laughs> you fucking a whack job. Down. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, hmm. we need you now. Or never. Interesting. Good. So he had a black father boys? and a white Why you run off? Indian mother. Me? He's like. He's like really in between. Usually you'd be like darker. Since I was a boy. Hmm. 20 years. Yeah. Taught me to read. Tough. John too. Taught me a few other things. Him and Hosea. Huh. Interesting. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. Yeah, you have to turn into a fucking whack job and fucking. Because right. of fucking oh. Mr. Micah. How's that new horse? Amazing. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Huh. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. Huh. I hope they all Brown make it. Jack. I tried to ride the Count once. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. The Count. What a stupid name. Ah, ah, ah. Yo, everybody, we got food. We're, we're back. Pearson, you ready to fucking eat? Ready to eat fucking good? All of just yells and just hopes that everyone hears him. <laughs> Maybe they do hear him. Thank you for showing me how to use the bow properly. Yeah, I've so learned so much from this gang. There's a lifetime of practice to master. Damn, well, it does. Well, well. <sighs> so he's dropping on the floor. Just oh, body slam. Surprise. Spine buster. Camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old mm. friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. Fucking uncle. I do my huh. utmost to avoid. He loves me really. It's his sad way Fucking to show uncle. an affection. No, it is. His name's no, Uncle, and he's like, nobody's you. uncle. <laughs> well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Tuh. Jesus, what is it? <laughs> Maybe rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, it oh. seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest your hand, Charles. We'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? I guess it's so. easier if we do it together. I'll get to skin you. <laughs> you always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. <laughs> this really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. <laughs> you skinned that one, did you? Dumped on the floor there. <laughs> Just skin you too. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Arthur, you fucking you cracked me up, Mr. Morgan. That was easy. Huh. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. <laughs> you know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Yeah. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, <laughs> Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting. After all these years, yeah, well, 
We're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Oh, jeez. Slit its day. legs and fucking beat up for a few hours. Is that how they used to, like... <laughs> a few days later. Is that how they used to, like... You know how you, like, beat the meat? Not beat... <laughs> Beat the meat with the mallet to like flatten it out more. Back then, I just hung it up and just started fucking punching at it, like, bop, 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 and then got it flattened out. Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. <sighs> the winner's going away. Who the hell is Levit Leviticus Cornwall? I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Tam. Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. Fuck you, Reverend. You still here then? No one needs you anyway. <laughs> nah. Yeah, you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Parker. I think it's time for the train. No. Nope. Want me to come? Of course I do, but look at I was always ugly, Dad. <laughs> it's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Well, Abigail. Oh, there's, there's a little Jack. The boy wanted to see you, John. You see me now. What's left of me? Hmm. What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. You'll see plenty of that. You're a rotten man, John Marcy. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. <laughs> now, railway man. Wow. Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah, come on. What <laughs> you want from me, Jose? Yeah, of course not. I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Jose. We're living. Look at me. We're living. <laughs> Even you. But we need. Every time he's like, okay, we're gonna stay low. We're gonna do this. And then I'm like, okay, we gotta loot. We gotta loot. We gotta loot. We gotta loot. No. Gotta get more money. Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just, I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low yep. and then head back out west. I got a plan. Suddenly we're about to rob a train. I got a plan, Arthur. Have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Who is Leviticus Cornwall? Exactly. He's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob. It's so goofy. This is like the this is the good old old west stereotype of taking your horses and robbing a train. We're moving out. Follow me. This is so stereotypical, but it's true. Let's go, Dutch. When you go any fucking faster, I could pass you. If it would let me. So kindly provided to us by the O'Driscolls, the train will be coming north from Big nice. Valley. We're gonna pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. Okay. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. I'm gonna jump around to the Charles, train. You'll keep look out for any outriders. Oh, Charles comes with us. Thanks. By the way, I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer that run point. Lenny, Javier, I like you two this. take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's oh, what yeah. we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You and me, Morgan. Great. <laughs> Have you got a problem with that? Not if you keep uh, once, I was getting grouped with that motherfucker. Yourself, huh? Enough. After Bill blows the tracks, we're going to need to move fast. Damn right. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep. Okay, that's all. Yes, bro. Good. Now come on. Let's ride. Let's ride. Like we old fucking cowboys. Trying to have like Pawn Stars <laughs> or Storage Wars. So this reminds me of you know, the music. Just, just reminds me of that. I played this music and it's like Dave came out looking a little bit too shabby for himself with a with a <laughs> with with five hundred extra dollars. Jared and Brandy, well, 
they came out with nothing like fucking usual. <laughs> uh, Daryl and whoever the fuck his son's name was, they came out okay with free lunch, with fifty dollars to spare. <laughs> oh, that's funny. And Barry, well, we know what happened to Barry. He spent way too much. He spent spent ten grand and fucking lost all of it. What a fucking idiot. <laughs> Team save last night. Man on his horse. Just happy we're back at it, doesn't oh. it? You sure you're ready oh, for Steve. this kid? Of course I'm ready. Just stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. Fuck you, Mike. Get out of here. You. No mistakes. Not again. So we do this, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. Yeah, okay. How many times you gonna ask the same question, Mike? That's oh, a lot so. of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we oh, go no. back. And that's the end of it. Money and shake. that's the bottom line. The the Stone Cold said so. And if the O'Driscolls are right, the Fuck you, does I passed you. On this train. I passed or beat you. Hold up here on the ridge. Oh yeah, there they are. Bill there? Yeah. Where's that Bill? Oh, there's Bill. Down. See how he's getting on? Okay. I guess so. Cause Bill is a fucking idiot. <laughs> yeah. Oh, here we go. Yo, Bill. Yo, Billy Bob Bill. Billy Bob Blowjob. How you getting on? Yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Of course. You don't have dynamite, though. Okay, sure. Now just right, pull the wire and then attach it to said detonator. <laughs> there you go. It's interesting how fucking dynamite works. I always, I always found it interesting. It's like you push that down and then it sends the power to the thing and then blows it up. Or it lights the sorry, it lights up the fucking thing and it blows it up. It's cool. Nifty. This is good. All right. That should do. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. All right, Captain. It's cool how diamond works. <laughs> about, about time. Fuck you, asshole. Whoever said that? Was that you, Micah? And remember the plan, all of you. No mistakes. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? Damn right. So. Okay, cover your faces. The train should be here and Oops, what are you doing here? Bandana. Oh, I didn't put it on. There we go. Oh baby. Train heisting away. Gentlemen, it's time. Good luck, all of you. You all know what to do. Damn right we do. Oh shit! Here we go. Bang! Oh my god! No! What? God! Oh, you have got to be kidding me! <laughs> Who <laughs> said it was fine? My Come on! You're pathetic. Jesus you know Christ. <laughs> it didn't fucking work. Oh my god. I just shouldn't be surprised about that, but uh... Oh no! Everyone else fucking fell off. How you're. Ha! <laughs> Javier fell off and Lenny's fucking hanging. Oh my hey, god, dude. Here. Fucking idiots. Yeah, he didn't make it. He fell. The others will get him. Come on, we need to stop this. 
A few assholes. Yeah, well, uh, two of them just got fucking blown away. You ain't gonna get me. Oh, wait, where was that? What's this guy doing over here? To take something. Oh. What the hell is Bill doing? He had long enough to set that charge. Well, I hooked up the wire, but we won't mention that. <laughs> He was supposed to fucking hook it up to both fucking hot and the ground, and he didn't do that. Well, he linked it up to one. What well, platinum pocket watch? Nice. <laughs> I got these guns. Fucking no, you don't. All you got was a bullet in the fucking head. That's all you got. Hey, do you wanna like hit me? I'm okay. Like. You gotta hurry. We have to stop this. Like, do you wanna fucking hit me with the fucking cheese? Oh! Che Damn! Dude! He fucking hit me with a fucking shuffle. What a fucking motherfucker. No, don't worry, I'll beat him up. Fucking... The train driver was trying to fucking kill me. <laughs> he tried to kill me, dude. That was fucking stupid. He tried to fucking kill me. He hit me with a shovel. Thought that was gonna take out Arthur. Nah, mate. That was fucking stupid. Funny, but stupid. Yep. <laughs> what the fuck happened to that guy? <laughs> He's like, blue got, got pushed off or something. He's fucking Levitic Leviticus Cornwall, can't say his name. <laughs> what happened to that guy? What happened to that guy? He just fell, bumped his head and fucking just shot him. Oh my god. I can't hit shit, dude. Holy shit. I can't hit shit. There we go, we're good. <laughs> Everyone's got run over. Sorry, Leviticus. Go on, get the money in run. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't I love how they put like, the fucking bandanas on and like you can't see our identities. I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We are opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. <laughs> Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake him up a little. Fucking wasting ammo. Oh, the story is shit. That's enough. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. Damn right. You two boys go blow that door open. Fucking do it. Now don't matter too much to us, but you boys in Oops. there, I'm gonna I want to take a step back. Good old. Seems good enough. Now lighten the fuse and here we go. Good old dynamite. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, <laughs> fellas. <laughs> Let's go, boys. Bam! All right, come on. Out here. Yeah, boys got out of here. Get on up there. Search that train. Let's go, boys. Mike, get the fuck out of the way. 
I love when Mike is the first one that gets to go in. Dude, I want to go in. Oh, you did fucking hit triangle, not square. What the hell, man? Look at this place. Wow. It's like a palace. Now I've seen everything. That was oh, nice. You got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. Take that. You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? The fuck? I didn't pick it up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Good to see you rushing to jump on that train. A cigar. Platinum pocket watch, another one? Nice. Okay. Let's see if we can get this open. Fine brandy, yes. Another letter that for some reason can't pick up. Glitching out. What about this cabinet? Oh, there's a cigar there. Ooh, a lockbox. There it is. There's the good stuff. Railroad contracts, invoices. Think I got him. A bond. There we go. Thank God. Come on. Hold on. Ooh, bill stack, and premium cigarettes. Twenty-five bucks. Nice. Can I kind of look at this? Let me pick it up this time. No. Are you done in there? Oops. Oh wait. I want to inspect something. Do I... Oh, never mind. On you, I said look at the card or something. No. We got twenty five bucks and what a bunch of bonds. bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we could probably sell these pretty easily. Well, don't. Our bond, exactly. Get rid of all of this. Train? Yeah, uh, get it out of hmm. here. What about them? What do you think? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Oh my god. Leave them here. Arthur just fucking took his bandana off. He didn't even have it on to begin with. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you what get back, Arthur do shit? we'll be moving on. The rest of you! Let's ride! Haha. <laughs> Let's ride, cowboys. Now, what are we gonna do with them? Okay. Get on the train. Quick. Hold it. Control stick of dynamite, light it, and kill them all. So behave. Come on. Move. We won't tell a soul, I swear. Come on. You motherfuckers. I hear so much as a footstep in this car. You'll end up like all your friends out here. Hey, you motherfuckers. I wanna fucking do it. I'm so tempted to do it. But I'll let you guys fucking live. Just this once. I'll let you live. Come on, horsey. Get over here. How long we let the train go? I think I would start it up. This thing will just go and go and go until, like, fucking. until you stop it. Literally. Or you have no more coal left, I guess. You gotta put coal in the furnace and get it to go. Oh man. We did quite a bit. Ugh. We did quite a bit today. Let's see what Dutch has for us when we get back to camp. But I think this is probably a probably a good place to wrap it up for today. But we'll we'll see what happens though. Out of this We're gonna try. What's well, using? And we just robbed a Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, Jeff. Damn right, man. So the question is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. 
We'll be able to hide out there no problem as long okay. as we keep our noses clean. Well then let's go. Clean <laughs> noses and everything else. Just drag them on, just do them on the floor. Bring <laughs> Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. <laughs> Traveling once again with this glorious music playing in the background as we travel to the next camp that we will form as we continue our amazing journey through Red Dead Redemption 2 and this wonderful country that we live in. <laughs> Trying to make it as epic as possible. Here we go, boyos. Boyos and joyos. As we get to the next amazing place that we will call home for our, a few months, I presume. Because we always gotta run from the Lao. We always gotta run from them Lao dogs. Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me with the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. Buy me a whiskey? Or you can buy me some whiskey. Fucking racist bastard. <laughs> Amazing. Oh. Hello? Oh, it's just loading, okay. That was fucking scary. I was like, uh oh. Why did I go black screen? The fuck happened? What the fuck happened? Game breaks. Oh my god. Oh my god. It is loading, which is strange because it cut out like right away. Looks like we were just about to like. Drive the wagon to next to our next camp, but oh my god! Oh, that seems a little sketchy. Didn't like fade out or anything; just cut right off. Oh boy! Well. I don't know what to fucking say. <laughs> We're stuck in the unknown. We're stuck in the unknown. Is it gonna load up or is it not gonna load up? Are we gonna get stuck here or is it gonna crash? Is fucking the world gonna blow up? Like, is my face just gonna melt? Is my TV that I'm playing this on just gonna blow up and combust? Two million shards that hit me in the face. God damn, dude. Well, <laughs> I think this is it for Dutch and the Boys. <laughs> not even, not even two hours in, and fucking. Oh boy. Oh man. What the fuck is it doing, dude? What the fuck is it doing? It's making me nervous now. I was just gonna fucking, we're just gonna ride with Jose and we're gonna talk about the good old days and how Dutch is going crazy. And then fucking, I guess Dutch fucking, uh, just cancelled us. He's like, oh, nope. I don't wanna hear people talking shit about me again. Even though if it's true or not.
Oh, it is loading, so I don't know if that's... God damn it, man. Uh... Okay, this is fucking... Okay, yeah, it didn't fucking... It didn't freeze or anything. It's still going. But I don't know how much longer I have to wait here. Until we load into the next... Cutscene or next part of the game, I don't know. Jesus Christ. Jesus. Okay, well, I guess this is where we're gonna end it because I don't know what the fuck happened. So, thanks for tuning in, thanks for watching, and we'll uh, we'll see you when this game fucking works. If it does, bye.